Hey everybody, as you can tell in the title, today's video is about a jailhouse break. And my head is, here we go, a jailhouse break. So you can do this break in prison as well, but different um, ingredients. But before I go on, let me just say I am I do not glorify prison or think I'm cool or anything like that. Prison is a very bad place. I'm a recovering addict of June 8th will be five years and I take my recovery very seriously. I am a changed uh, person. Good people make bad decisions and get caught. And good people make bad decisions and don't get caught. But anyway, as you can tell in the title, it's a prison jail recipe. For all you that are new here, I'm JoJo. Thank you, welcome. And for all my returning OGs, mwah, thank you for coming back. I love you guys so, so much. So y'all, I got this all scattered out. I'm gonna start with, okay, in Ohio, um, jail they are famous for the grippos that's a lot of light on there but it's grippos so that's why i'm calling it a jailhouse break so you'll need grippos you'll need a slim jim which i've already chopped up in little pieces and now mind it y'all the little um id cards that's what we have to chop stuff up with in prison and jail so um, yeah, um, and the Raymond noodles, I busted, like we used to slam them down on the ground to get them broken up, so I busted the bag open some, so I put it in a baggie, and I added just a little bit of water, and you just leave them there until they, like, they're done right now. So, <laughs> you can use any kind of chips, you can use summer sausage. I have a lot of different recipes and uh, each individual that's ever did a prison break, jail break, whatever, they make it different. And I got some hot peanuts, cheese puffs, crushed them up, and I've already crushed them up just to save some time, uh, you know, on the video. I've already, like, well, there's a few in here that I have not crushed up. Carrie, sorry y'all, I need my cheese. Will you bring me the cheese that's in that bag? Sorry, I forgot the cheese, y'all. Okay, and then some regular Cheetos, cheese puffs, get you a pickle, and they used to only sell the hot pickles. Use your imagination, so they sold the hot pickles. Um, oh. And the Slim Jim is in here, y'all. It's in little bitty pieces. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And they would never sell anything in glass or anything like that. It was always in a bag or plastic. Um, the cheese squeeze was like this, about this long, like one single use. But I got this cheese squeeze. They didn't have jalapeno, so I got this. Anyway. Oh, and you're gonna need a cup of hot water. This is just hot water. Now, so these are all squished. We're gonna add we're gonna add our Cheetos. Sometimes I would add um, we're gonna add these with the meat in it in there. Everything just goes into the biggest bag. And sometimes, well, a lot of times, we would use um, the gar a garbage, a clean garbage bag, that is. Um, yeah, so. And you, I know what y'all thinking, like, yuck, yuck, yuck. I promise you, like, you'll like this, I promise. You can do it with or without the noodles. And 
if you've ever seen anybody make a prisoner jail house break, pickle or pizza, jail house, prison pizza, pickle, prison tacos, pickle, everything's pickle. <laughs> so the new tools are done. We're going to add in our noodles in here as well. There we go. Done. Seasoning packet. This has a lot. I'm only going to add probably, well, no. We'll just do all the seasoning packet. Heck with it. A lot of sodium, y'all. And then, of course, your pickle and pickle juice. You might not need any water, but just in case you want to, I've got to cut that up a little bit more because that pickle did not get cut up. Sorry, y'all. Mm -hmm. For some reason, I got... Because in jail, I would take my fingers and just go like this and break the pickle up into pieces so I didn't have to cut it with my, my um, you know, my, uh, or my ID card. Y'all, I don't know why I'm not get to just getting a knife and doing this, but uh, doing it the hard way because I'm hard-headed. Should pause this, but it's worth it. Right. It's easier if you just like cut it, chop it up with your fingers, like like so. I know what you're all thinking, like yuck, yuck. Wait till y'all see. Some of my other recipes, you're gonna be like, oh my God, Jojo, you're crazy. But I promise you, y'all, I'm gonna put the uh, what you need down in the description box. And if like you don't live anywhere that has um, Rippos, then you just squish it up. If you don't live anywhere that has Rippos, then just use your favorite chip. You can always use, you know, your favorite chip. And if you, for some reason, put too much um, water or pickle juice or whatever in it, which says, will you give me another bag of chips? upstairs here I put a little bit too much pickle juice see that happens but that's okay you can tell by the consistency of it like you don't want it real mushy but you uh, the cheesy kind please you don't want it real mushy but you don't want it uh, real dry you want it just right and you'll be able to feel if it's just right thank you daughter so if you do that, like I just did, you take you another and you crunch some more up. Everybody's been asking me to do a recipe, so that's why I'm doing it. I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Uh, please, if you haven't by now, uh, subscribe, please subscribe and join the JoJo's Fan Bam. We'd love to have you. Not everything I talk about is about prison. It's about mental health, uh, recovery, positivity. You know, just spreading the love. Because I general, I love you guys so, so much. Okay, so... I usually take something and bang it, or you can just, you know, do your...
take your aggression out on the chips like <laughs> um, okay all right so this should be just about the right amount and this empty it in Bing, just like that now this should be that should be thin enough and you just take the bag and kind of just you're gonna laugh, y'all. <laughs> but when this is done, I'll show you what we do. Uh, but then you like set it up in your um, the county jail uh, in Ohio. They're in in your room. They had like a window seal with windows. You could see out. I mean, they were real tiny. Like you could put your head. You could go like this. And kind of look out no one could see in but we used to put it up there and, and say uh, the break is bacon <laughs> crazy I know but it would literally like be bacon because the longer you set it up in the window and the window seal was always no matter if it was a hundred degrees out the window seal is always ice cold because it's cold in, in, in jail because you know they're trying to keep the the germs out, which they don't do a very good job at. But you see what I'm, I don't know if y'all can see in there. I know, I know y'all, y'all are saying, yeah, yeah. And then you just take it and you form a, you form a like a, I don't know, like if it's a cake or something. There we go. Make sure it's even. Okay. And believe it or not, one person could would eat this. I would personally make me one, and it would last me an entire day. Um, so, yeah. Uh, they used to bring the commissary in the morning time. So, yeah. First thing in the morning, I'd be eating a break. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay. So, it's bacon, right? So, get your cheese ready. Ooh. Jalapeno cheese is better. Okay, this is what we would do. Break it open. Like so. Well, I'm trying to get okay, y'all. Sorry, continuing on. Then you add your cheese on top, like so. How much ever you want, you know, depends on how much <laughs> how much you uh, you know, how much you want. And like this, and put a little bit more on it, and like that. I'm gonna take a bite, and it would look like this. And then we would just eat it out of a bag with our spoon, or put it in our bowl with a lid. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Okay, now, take a bite. Ooh-wee. Here, I'll give y'all first bite. Yes. Mm, mm, mm. Wow. Y'all, try this. If you do, let me know in the comments. I will put everything you need down to make it. And there's more recipes to come. Y'all, I'm doing a 30-day challenge. A video starting a day, every day for 30 days. So please like, comment, and share. And as, as always, y'all, I love y'all. I love y'all so, so much. If you haven't already, subscribe. And ring the notification bell. 
to be notified. Um, Y'all, until next time, remember, love yourself, respect yourself, love some, love, love people, you know, give someone a smile because you never know what they might be going through. That smile might save their life. Y'all, again, I know I keep saying I love you, but I love y'all so, so much. Y'all fill my heart with so much joy. Mwah. And happy Valentine's Day, y'all. I love you. Until next time, bye.